Yo, what's up, people? Now that I have you here and then I've taken all your attention away from whatever else you're doing. Hi. Howdy. How you feeling? Good? Okay. Well, let's <laughs> let's talk about this trailer real quick. Like, I was going to I was going to do a reaction to it and whatnot. But then I just saw it was sales saga and I was like, nah, it, it wouldn't be worth it. I'm not going to not going to feel hyped about any of this, really, you know? And the funny thing is, the Cell Saga is my favorite saga of, of Dragon Ball Z. And I was like, the, the problem is, most of the characters from that saga have been shown already, right? Like, there's, there's not enough to announce here, I would think, to get its own trailer. But, you know, it was, it was visually pleasing. Let's let's say that it looked nice, basically. It's like, yeah, you know, it's a cool looking trailer and whatnot. But at the same time, it didn't really give us much. I guess technically it gave us. Uh, I I have it here as like 15 characters, which some of which I I I thought were already <laughs> in something else, but. With the way the trailers were going, uh, a couple of times there they showed characters but didn't, you know, fully give them a, a name card and whatnot. Kind of like Bardock, he's a perfect example. They showed him in a trailer but didn't say much about him, and they show him on the end screen with all the characters and whatnot, but he's still not even on the list on the website of characters, which is freaking weird. So I'm assuming at some point in the trailer they'll they'll pop off and show Bardock and whatever anyway looking at this though because like also you know they have the, the the people that have been putting out gameplay at these different events and stuff so I thought Jero had been announced because I see <laughs> I saw somebody playing with him at one of the events and I was like oh okay okay so when they popped him up here I was like he hadn't been announced yet in a in a trailer that's it's weird <laughs> uh, yeah so if we want to get technical you know you know how it is with this stuff because characters are, are announced by transformations too so technically we had what uh, five six characters that I believe were announced for this because the rest were like transformations, you know, sales, first form, second form, uh, and perfect sale, which is something that I mentioned in the other video where they had um, announced sale is sale perfect form. And I was thinking, well, maybe they'll have like super perfect sale or some junk. I don't know, but apparently they're just going to call that final form of sale just perfect sale which i don't have a problem with i i, I kind of like that it's just perfect sale but it's kind of annoying when you have sale perfect form and then perfect sale so it's it's always a problem with sale when we get to those last two forms because the naming's always weird anyway they announced the z version of 17 which we all knew there was going to be a Z version of 17, of course. And that that's going to be the fun 17. <laughs> Z 17 is going to be the fun one to use. Uh, like, I, I, I feel it. I feel it deep in my soul. Z 17 is going to be the fun 17. Uh, I mean, we'll see. But that's, that's what I'm guessing here. And then um, we had uh, friggin' base form melee trunks. And because they already announced him in his Super Saiyan form and the Super Trunks form, there's that that's it's a non announcement. <laughs> like, <laughs> it'd be wild if you had his other two forms and not the base form. So, that was a character we could all just assume was there. Same with Teen Gohan, they, they decided to go with Teen. Same with Teen Gohan, it's like we knew he was coming, but uh, you know. When you do the sales saga, you have to have to announce them. And it's like, yeah, you know, 
technically he's a reveal, but at the same time, do you think he wasn't going to be there? Same with 16. Uh, 19 actually was a, a coin toss. You know what I'm saying? And to some games, 19 just doesn't make it. It is what it is. So it's nice to see that 19 is in here. You know what I'm saying? Then uh, Cell Jr., of course. Have to have Cell Jr., which again, that that's also a character that sometimes doesn't make it into things. Which, uh, you know, it's rare that Cell Jr. doesn't make it in, but sometimes they just ignore Cell Jr. Then we have King Cole and Mecha Frieza, which King Cold is a character that <laughs> sometimes doesn't make it into stuff. But I get why you, you wouldn't put King Cold in there. He didn't do anything, you know? And then you have Mecha Frieza, which you got to have Mecha Frieza. It's, that's a character you can't ignore. But the um, the thing that was, was wild to me is they 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 had um, a, a, an announcement for freaking Super Saiyan sword trunks. I'm not even going to get into that today. I don't I don't even want to sit here and be upset at the fact they're calling uh, future trunks from Z sword trunks and future trunks from super future trunks it, it it's still stupid like bruh you have here's the thing if there weren't other characters that just had their name and z next to it i wouldn't have a, as much of a problem but it's like bro you could have just called them future trunks z and future trunks super it's weird to call one trunks sword when they both have swords but it, I, I'll get over it. Don't worry. I, I, I'll get over it. It's what I do. I get over things. Right. Right. I'm glad we all agree. Anyway. So, yeah, overall, the trailer was, was kind of meh, you know. Like, it was, it was decent to look at, but nothing that you didn't already fully expect to be there. There were no real surprises in it. That's why I said, um... You know, when I saw it was Cell Sock, I was like, nah, there's no need to do any type of reaction to this because it's going to be a, a bunch of characters that, that we already assumed would be there. Like, with Boo Saga, it's, it's similar, right? But there are characters that didn't previously make it into games that they could throw in as a shock, you know? So that one, like if this would have said Sail Saga and Boo Saga, I, I might have got excited enough to actually, you know, turn on that camera and get ready. But nah, nah, we're just going to get what we got. Freaking Gohan, uh, 17, 16, 19, Jiro, Sail, Sail Jr. Uh, freaking Piccolo fused with Kami, which... We knew was gonna be there, but I was kind of surprised that they just threw him out there like that, you know? Because I just, I just assumed Piccolo would be Piccolo, so <laughs> oh, it, it was kind of weird for him to pop him up, and I was like, oh yeah, yeah okay. <laughs> but yeah, nothing, nothing crazy here. We'll just be sitting around waiting on that next trailer to pop off, you know what I'm saying? Which, the thing with the whole um, Boo Saga trailer, there'll be a, a similar thing going on, but not exactly the same. Because with Boo Saga, a lot of characters from that have been shown already, too. I kind of wish that they hadn't done the trailers the way they did at the beginning. You know, where they were like, oh, this is, this is, um freaking fusions and, and swords and, and speed and power and stuff you know if they would have just did trailers like this from the start I think would have been better off just doing the different sagas as trailers because now you've seen a ton of the characters in other trailers so they make these trailers hit less you know they're less significant it's like oh we're doing this saga but we've already seen most of the characters from that saga you know so nothing's going to just hit the way it should. Anyway, that's going to do it for this. Just wanted to talk about this for a little bit. 
Let me know what you guys thought about it down in the comments below, and I'll see you next time. Peace out, and have a great day.